So, hello Flight Simmers, it is Two Shot Cabo here and we're back in the Cessna 152. And so what I thought I would do today, um, because I've been doing quite a few bits of odd um, routes here and there and various things like that, but I thought that I would have, um, again I've been focusing on VFR flight, can we, can we VFR sensibly in, um, fly by VFR sensibly within um, Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. So today I thought I would do two things. Firstly is I wanted to do a test of um, uh, VATSIM. So I've been a VATSIM pilot previously on different versions of Flight Sim and I find that VATSIM is by far the most realistic air traffic control available. Um, so I wanted to try out VATSIM now that Flight Simulator, the bug that was making Flight Simulator stutter has been fixed. Uh, so I'll be trying out VATSIM today and I am actually already logged on to the VATSIM server here. You can see at the top I have vPilot open. Um, and what I thought I'd do just to do that and also to try a bit more VFR is just fly some circuits uh, in Flight Simulator with um, the Cessna 152. So back to basics, the kind of uh, aircraft that people would use for flying lessons for their first flying lessons, probably in a 152 or some kind of similar airport aircraft. So I thought we'd take the 152 for a quick spin around Barton, uh, in Man back at Manchester Barton where we landed the other day, which is a grass runway, a uh, grass field runway. Um, so we'll just give it, give it a spin and see how we get on. Um, so I'm just going to pick up, get a jump into the aircraft and uh, we'll pick up the ATIS and we'll see what's going on. So here we are in the aircraft. Get rid of the yoke. And we'll see what we got. Uh, carb heat is cold. Throttle all the way out. Mixture is all the way out. Uh, we'll pop our beacon on. And we'll go mixture full rich. Throttle in about a quarter of an inch. And check the brakes. So brakes look good. And then we need to uh, check the prop is clear. Well, there is a chap there, but I think he, he knows. So I'll just shout, clear for starting, starting prop. Uh, master on. Battery master, that is. And we'll start the engine. Let's just prime it, because I don't know if it's been... That's the parking brake. <laughs> That's not going to do anything. There we go. <laughs> Maybe a little bit more throttle. Uh, wait a minute, we've done some, something we've not done here. Fuel shut off valve. Huh. It's getting there then. There we go, got there eventually, and we'll set a um, thousand RPM. Just tune one to one point eight because there's no control here on uh, this airport. Okay, let's see if we can let's turn some things on here. 
Uh, so let's pop on the uh, what have we got? And the alternator. Pop the dome light on just so we can have a look what we're doing. We probably don't need it for the actual flight. Um, should be good for now. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go over to AGC Atis. Double click on that and I'm going to have a look what it's giving us. So given us the, the Manchester Airport is the nearest controlled airport and basically it's given us uh, some information they're using 05 left uh, surface wind 29 at 0 13 oh no sorry 290 at 13 knots ok visibility is 10 kilometres and it's 1011 for the QFE QNH 101020 so I'm gonna need to uh, adjust my uh, QNH here. Um, I have mine set for the US standard but of course we're flying in the UK so uh, I'm just going to see if I can change that so let's go to general and let's go to graphics, no data, no flight model, MISC international settings, the interface language accessibility, no hmm. wonder how we change I wonder how we change that. Hmm, I'd be interested to know. I have no idea off the top of my head how I change the setting for the altimeter calibration. Uh, maybe it's in here, navlog, objectives, travel to. No. No. So we're going to taxi out to runway 9 I think, is it runway, no runway 8, so we're probably going to do a left hand circuit runway 8, so taking off from 8 left and then a left hand circuit to land back on 8 left and then we may even do a full stop and try a right hand circuit on uh, 8 right, um, but first we'll taxi, so I'm just going to have a quick look here at the looks like we need to taxi down to B1 and then a long taxiway Bravo to hold at B4 Barton traffic, Barton traffic, Cessna 152 uh, Golf, Foxtrot, November, Romeo Hotel taxiing, taxiway Bravo for departure and take off on 08 right Okay, so we've told the traffic of our intention. And I have a little look round to make sure there's nobody anywhere near us. And there isn't. So we will start to move. Not going to bother with a pushback today. I'm just going to turn to the left. Ah, and we've got the park brake on of course we have as usual and the 152 taxiing a lot better than some of the other aircraft at present here in flight simulator some of them are truly ridiculous with their taxiing so taxiway Bravo should be over here straight in front of us Seem to have got stuck there a little bit. So we'll pop flaps down for takeoff. And taxiway Bravo is somewhere over here on the grass. So I'm going to just head over there now and have a look. I think 
this might be the taxiway here. It's quite hard to see. I've completely lost the view of whatever taxiway this is or anything now, so let's try and see. I'm pretty sure that's the runway over there, so I think if I just keep heading in that direction, we might uh, get there. It's supposed to be a taxiway here. Ah, there's a hold. Okay, so let's just stop at the hold there. And we'll just have a quick power check. Is that parking brake? Set power. Just check the mags. Okay. Release the parking brake and we'll tell people our intention and we'll head to the runway. Barton traffic, Barton traffic, Cisco November Romeo Hotel. Entering runway 08 right for takeoff. So here's 08 right, and we've just run out, <laughs> run out of power there. It's quite difficult to see um, what the different runways, etc., are. Were we doing 08 right? We we're going to do a right hand. No, we were going to do 08 left. Well, we've said 08 right now, so we're going to do 08 right for a right hand circuit. So let's do that. We've said that now. And what we need to do is just pop on our lights. So we should have had the taxi lights on, but we didn't do that. Pop on our strobe, nav, and we'll pop the pitot heat on. And let's go. Knots. Up we go. Stay over the runway. And we'll fly out following runway heading. And cross the motorway, which we have done just there. the motorway bridge and fi finally making a turn to the south and we'll be climbing to 1000 feet flaps on airport back there. So just level off here at 1000 feet.
Then we're gonna make a turn to the west. Barton traffic, Cessna, Golf, Foxtrot, November Hotel, Romeo, making downwind leg, 08 to right. So we're on our downwind leg, we're a little high, so we'll just come down a little bit. Overshot the tiny bit there. should be able to see the airport passing by on the other side, there it is, I can see it There's the runway, we're about level with the airfield now on our downwind leg. And we're just going to start to prepare ourselves uh, for landing, so I'm going to pop in the flaps and we're going to turn to base. Barton traffic, Cessna, Fo Golf Foxtrot, November Romeo Hotel, turning base, runway 08 right. And we're just descending now to 500 feet. And there's the runway on that side. Up in our next set of flaps. And we will turn to final. Barton Taffic, Self Snow Golf, Foxtrot November Romeo Hotel, turning base, turning final, sorry, for 08 right. And we're nicely lined up there on the final approach and we'll just reduce our speed now as we come in. Gear is fixed. And it's the right hand of the two runways that we're going to be landing on, not the left hand. Very important that we get that correct. And it's for a touch and go. And here we go, 60 knots, little power. And that's perfect, flaps up and powerful. Oh, it's a little bit bumpy. And up we go. bit nose high there, don't want to stall. I'm at a slightly higher rate. Same again, we cross the motorway bridge, passing the Trafford Centre shopping centre on the right. We'll wait till we get just past there and we'll turn right. Climbing turn, flaps up.
I haven't turned enough here but I'm going to turn a little bit more now we turn round to the west level off at a thousand feet Barton Tafric, Cessna November Romeo Foxtrot on downwind leg, runway 08 right just lose a bit of speed there and we'll just come down a little bit and the flaps are up and we should be able to see the airport soon there's the, run, there's the motorway so we're not far off being keep stay at a thousand feet here There is the airport, we're a little closer to the airport than we were last time. I didn't I kinda got the turning a little bit wrong. Um, we'll just fly along. Again, excellent ground scenery. Um I used to live down here somewhere. I think I used to live in that house there in fact. I think that's my house. <laughs> Lost a bit, a bit too high there. That's what comes when you're not paying attention and you're looking out the window. And we'll just check uh, where the airport is. Just popping off into the distance there. I think time to turn. Cessna November Romeo Hotel, turning base, runway 08 right. And we'll just drop our speed a little bit now and we'll descend, flaps in. Descend down to 500 feet. quick look to see that we are online we are online turning for finals so it's a Cessna November Romeo Hotel turning final 08 right button traffic there we go we have full flaps in we are descending bleeding speed down Ah, nice touchdown. It always sounds bad in flight simulator. Flaps up, full power. Barton traffic, golf, folks, not November, Romeo Hotel, Cessna going around. our nose down a little bit, gain a little bit of height here over the motorway flaps up
and we'll turn to join the pattern. Climb into a thousand feet. And a thousand feet per minute, sorry, a thousand feet altitude, the level off there. Bring the power back and turning downwind leg. Barton traffic, Cessna Clockstrot November Romeo Hotel, turning downwind, runway 08 right. Back to strain level at a thousand feet, just drop our height a little bit, drop our speed a little bit. Tried to go a little bit wider this time on the pattern. It's a little bit too close to the airfield, I think, last time. A few golf courses down there, various other things. And we should be able to see the airport passing by, there it is. And this will be a full stop landing this time. Where's the airport? We're about level with the airfield. Airport, airfield, it's definitely an airfield because it's made of grass, I mean, I'm not sure what the exact thing is that qualifies it as being an airfield or not being an airfield, but in this case it's definitely an airfield because it's made of grass. Okay, so we're going to start to descend to 500 feet, and we're going to turn base leg Sex, uh, November Romeo Hotel, turning base, runway 08 right, full stop landing. And one flaps in. Power back. Descended to 500 feet. There's the airfield. Barton traffic, Cesta November Romeo Hotel, turning final 08 right for full stop landing. Power back, flaps in, a little bit off, a little bit undershot there. But we're okay. Power coming back, both flaps are in, gear is fixed. Bit of power. Now we're back, 55 knots. Power idle. And there we go, and we're down. Clean up, flaps up. Taxi off the end.
Button Traffic, Golf, Foxtrot November Hotel, Romeo is clear of the active taxi into parking. And there's an actual proper taxiway here, which is fun. So we'll follow the actual proper taxiway round to the parking area where we started. Bit of a downhill roll there. We're just going to park it up on the left hand side here. Excellent. Parking brake on. And engine. Shut off. Very good. And we can just kill some of these lights now. Powers to off. Power switch off. Park brake is on. Close the fuel shut off valve. Well there we go. I hope you enjoyed that quick uh, hop around in the Cessna 152. A couple of uh, circuits there. And also um, we didn't get to hear any... Um, air traffic control conversations on um, VATSIM but we certainly got to use VATSIM uh, connection here to get the ATIS and also to give our position to the Unicom for the uncontrolled airport and um, we will also be able to see um, um, we will also be able to we also can see that there was no slowdown so previously there was a slowdown of flight simulator when you were using uh, v pilot on that sim and there was definitely no slowdown today so that's excellent thank you very much for joining me here and join please join me again on one of my other videos soon two shot cowboy out <laughs>